in this clip you will learn how to create the parallax effect with crop and zoom techniques. Let's get into it. The parallax effect occurs when the backdrop moves faster than the foreground. This effect works nicely when the camera in the clip is moving away from the central item and there are things in the backdrop that are far away. Let's begin by speeding up the clip so that the effect is noticeable and appealing. Right click on the clip in the timeline and then select speed, speed and duration from the flyout or press ctrl r to open the custom speed dialog box. Set speed to 3 and then click ok to speed up the clip. Right click on the timeline and then select video crop and zoom from the flyout or press alt c to open the crop and zoom window. Navigate to the pan and zoom tab and then select the end rectangle by clicking on it. Resize the end rectangle and then set it like this. Play the sequence to see the parallax effect. So that's a look at how to use pan and zoom effect to create the parallax effect. If the camera is moving towards the center object, you can enable from near to far preset in the crop and zoom window and then reposition the start rectangle to create the effect. 